Hey guys, this is Brady McDonald of the LA Times. We're getting set to do a periscope inside the Star Wars launch bay. Uh, this is sort of their merchandise, new merchandise area, specifically just for uh, sort of the new stuff that's launching the season of the Force. I'm Brady McDonald with the LA Times. You can follow me at LA Times Funland on Twitter and on Periscope. Please let your friends know uh, right now. Share this that uh, we're inside the merchandise shop, uh, inside Interventions, and we're going to be walking around showing you guys what's inside. So I've got a few of you guys here, so let your friends know at LA Times Funland, and I'm going to take you guys around and show you some of the merchandise here now inside Star Wars launch day at Disneyland Season of the Force. You guys ready? Here we go. Any questions, just, just uh, make a comment in the uh, comment section there and I'll try to answer them as we go along. I'm probably not going to be able to give you guys prices on all this stuff tonight because they've left those off for the most part. But we'll see here. Oh, I take that back. Prices on everything. Prices on everything. I'm wrong. I'm wrong. I'm wrong. Okay. So starting over here. Star Wars First Order Special TIE Fighter. Get some model kits. Can't imagine you're making anything quite like that. They look pretty cool. Remote Control Millennium Falcon. Go around this one. Look at that. It's probably about a four foot tall. Let's see. Try me. Let's see what's up. Move out. Let's go. One more time. Taking you into custody. And there's a little Kylo Ren there. Kind of too dark to see, so I love that. They're coming around this side. Snap tight, Max. Over here on the wall. Basically, artwork. Take you guys across. For the most part, we're looking at like. 300, 400, 500 dollar range, that kind of stuff. So let's show you guys the wall. I'll move from left to right here, real quick. If you guys want to let your friends know that we're doing this live inside the merchandise shop at Star Wars Launch Bay. I'm at LA Times Funland, and they can follow us on Periscope and Twitter. Please share that with your friends. Let them know we're here. It's pretty beautiful, huh? Look at that. That looks awesome. Look at this one. Take it down for the lower one. Go from right to left this time. Added a new droid in there. Yep, you can buy everything you see here. Show you some of the prices. That's sort of in the neighborhood of where we're at. 500 bucks, that kind of thing. 300 bucks, 400 bucks. I don't imagine they're going to put it in a gift bag and let you walk out with it. I don't think I'd want to walk around the park with $500 worth of merchandise in a little bag, but I imagine they'll let you pick it up later. I believe that is a $9,000 life-size First Order Stormtrooper statue. Would you like a, a Boba Fett monument figure? Only $3,050. They look pretty cool. Look at that. Welcome home, honey. <laughs> Alright, so here's a uh, Darth Vader. $2,000. Darth Vader life size bust. And I have to say, that is about the accurate size for what the Darth Vader I just saw. And moving over here, some merchandise on the walls. I was out for Force Friday. Lamps. When, I, you know, I took photos of you know, lightsaber lights, lamps. And it's pretty yeah. Limited edition oh, maquettes. Special, uh, their special, their specialty toys. So mm -hmm. they're only a 10% discount, so you don't get the right. discount anymore. Okay. So what is my next, uh, what time is my next? Little maquettes. So for example, the Stormtrooper is 400 bucks. And then the R2-D2 is 175 And the Tatuan, Tuan Tuan, is uh, 400 bucks. Pretty cool, huh? Oh, wow. I'm sure what's going on with this R2-D2 up here. He's got something coming out of his head. <clears throat> so then there's these signed autographed photos. Okay. Dave Prowse signed the autograph. 
Darth Vader. Carrie Fisher autographed. This one's autographed by both of them, so that's 600 bucks. Autographed by both of them. Uh, $1,200 down there in the bottom. Yeah. That's why, this is why this is not a normal uh, Star Trader merchandise shop. This is, uh, you might need two credit cards to buy this stuff. Real nice. But if let's say you don't have $1,200 in your pocket right now, you can get one of these lovely Star Wars lunch bag t shirts. <laughs> Alright, so some more of the artwork that's available. We saw some of this over there. This is behind the cash register. It's all sort of past. I have to get a little bit further away here because I probably don't want me behind the cash register. Moving from left to right. So you guys can let uh, everybody know we're at LA Times Funland and at Periscope and Live inside the Star Wars Launch Bay Merchandise Shop. Want to share that with your friends? I'd appreciate it. And then let's go on over here. More maquettes. You guys still with me? I didn't lose you, did I? A few hearts would help me now you're still there. Glad you guys are still here. These are metal laser prints. Hundred dollars. Millennium Falcon. These are unframed. Now I'm going to see if I can go over here, we'll see what happens once again. This is, uh, oh, this is location B, so this is probably, I'm not sure what's in location B here. But basically over there you got D-Tech on demand, so that's your, uh, your uh, cases for your cell phones and stuff like that. This is probably a place for uh, people to do stand-up with some merch and stuff like that. So for people who want to do video shoots and things like that. <coughs> and then over there, I think I can probably go over there, let's see what happens. <laughs> Yeah, so there's your that t-shirt we saw earlier. Uh, Imperial officer costume, you like one of those? 650 bucks. Han Solo costume. I'll let you guys take that in for a little bit. Oh, go ahead. $729 for that. There's that Star Wars lunch bag t-shirt. Probably the cheapest thing in the whole place. 32 bucks. Uh, there's that lightsaber. Imagine those are gonna be flying out. You'll see a bunch of people walking around with those. Yeah, this stuff is amazing. There it is right there. Kind of hard to see, but it's pretty awesome. And then if you would like one of the Stormtrooper or Darth Vader helmets, turn it And then there's the mirror one. I'm getting a little close to the center of the building here, so if you guys need a few parts and let me know that we're okay. <coughs> Thank you. Um, and then I think that's where Darth Vader is, I remember correctly now. He's back over here, so that is... Yeah, that's uh, where I lost you guys last time. <coughs> hey, there's Yoda. <coughs> now we're gonna head back up to the front of the building, and we're gonna wrap up here. <coughs> so. I want to thank you guys again. This is a merchandise shop inside Interventions in the Star Wars launch bay. Um, obviously, sort of your higher end merchandise here. Um, I think the lowest price thing you saw was like 33 bucks for a t shirt. Um, I think the highest price we saw was like $9,000 for a Stormtrooper full size <laughs> creature at the door type of thing. And um, so, obviously, bring your credit card. Maybe your whole entire paycheck when you come here. Um, anyway, uh, that is going to wrap it up for us here at Star Wars Launch Bay Merchandise Shop. Um, if you guys are still up for a few more, we're going to do a few more periscopes tonight. I still need to give you guys my review of Star Tours. We're going to do that in a little bit. 
I was hoping to show you some of the actual live food. We'll go over and get some of the food later on. And then um, I still have not seen uh, the trailer movie uh, in the old EO stage, so I'm hoping to do that later on tonight. So I think that's, what, three things maybe? Uh, so hopefully three more periscopes before the end of the night. Uh, thank you guys for following. If you can let people know uh, that you enjoyed it, please tell them uh, at LA Times Funland. Follow us. We've got three or four more periscopes tonight. Uh, basically, it wraps up tonight at 10 o'clock, and uh, that'll be it. But wanted to give you guys a look at the merchandise here. I'm Brady McDonald at the LA Times. Thank you guys for following, and I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, tell everyone at LA Times Funland, and uh, we'll see you guys in a few minutes with a few more periscopes later on tonight. Thanks a lot.